today kids this is teacher rona your grade for science teacher welcome to week four of our video presentation our lesson is still on the changes in solid materials how can i change solid materials what happened to solid materials when they are hammered and cut our lesson for today is all about changes in solid materials when they are hammered and cut. Hi kids! Good day to all of you! I am Kat the Cutter who lives in this material world. Since you have come to open my page, let me share with you my fund of interest. Let's play and learn together. Would that be interesting? Don't stop! Let's continue exploring. Look at the picture. What is he doing? What do you think are the changes that will happen to the paper after it has been cut? Can you name other solid materials found in your home, school, and community that can be cut? What is cutting? Cutting involves the use of physical forces to cut an object. It may be blade, scissors, or other mechanical tools into physical contact with the object being cut. Remember, always be careful in handling pointed and sharp objects like scissors. Remember, solid materials can be cut. When cut, these materials may change their size and shape, but no new material is formed. Only the physical appearance of the materials is changed. Not all solid materials can be cut using simple scissors. Some solid materials like iron, steel, can be cut using sophisticated cutters, example, metal cutters or machine cutters. Let me introduce to you my other friend. Please say hi to Hammy Hammer. He is my best friend in changing the size and shape of any materials. We're both happy breaking things apart. Hello, I am Hammy Hammer. Mr. Cut the Cutter is my super buddy and we like to change the appearance of different materials. While Mr. Cutter uses scissors to cut, I use his hammer to pound materials to change its size, shape, and texture. For me, it really rocks. Remember, hammering is a process of using a tool known as hammer to deliver an impact to an object. This is usually to drive nails, fix parts, forge metals, and break apart objects. A hammer is a hand tool usually consists of solid head held on the end of a handle. It is used for beating, striking, or pounding materials or objects. Remember, solid materials can be hammered. When hammered, these materials may change their size and shape and even the texture. However, no new material is formed because only the physical appearance of the material is changed. Take note kids, cutting involves the use of physical forces to cut an object. It may be blade, scissor, 
or other mechanical tools into physical contact with the object being cut. Hammering is a process of using a tool known as hammer to deliver an impact to an object. It is usually to drive nails, fix parts, forge metal, and break apart objects. Using different tools, they change the size, shape, texture, and weight of solid materials. No new material is formed, only changes its physical appearance. That's all for the concept kids about the change in solid materials when they are hammered and cut. This has been Teacher Rona. Thank you. Good luck kids in answering your module for week 4.